Good morning. It's Christmas. I think I look like my great grandfather. So this is your favorite picture of me, Mom? A little Jake in the water. Mom, what is one of your favorite memories of me when I was a kid? Probably when we were sitting on the couch together uh, watching TV. Okay. And what was I drinking? Chocolate milk. Chocolate freaking milk in my little red <laughs> sippy cup. Yes. That's a good memory. That's a good memory. When I lived in Rhode Island and I first started streaming, I would always do like two streams a day. My morning stream would always be followed up with a walk, some more coffee, and then I would go for my second stream. But I wanted to show you guys the path. You can't really tell, but I would walk this long road and it goes, it goes for like a mile straight. You know, knowing that I was sitting down for hours and hours, I always figured it would be good to to get some, some exercise in, get the blood flowing. Unique fun fact, little story for you guys. So my dad actually grew up here. This is the house that my dad grew up with, his like seven brothers and sisters. Right around the corner this way is where my grandmother lived. And she would actually watch some of my dad's brothers and sisters, ironically. And I actually also, for the first three months of my life, lived in the house that my, my grandmother like originally grew up in. It's cute. All right, so if you keep walking down the road, right here, there used to be this like swing for like babies. Like, you know, you lock them in. It would swing by itself, like legitimately swing. We're not talking like a little rock. Like this would literally swing back and forth with no wind. I've seen it myself swinging. And somebody one day finally made a video posted. If you'd like look it up, Rhode Island, like ghost swing or something like that. And it just like went crazy. And uh, I wanted to show you guys, but I don't know if it fell off, somebody took it down or the ghost that was swinging on it, you know, you know, outswung all the screws and it just, you know, got loose and disappeared. A little bit further down, we actually used to like come right here. We'd have like little fires. And I just remember like, it'd be like nighttime. We'd be sitting around the fires, trying to get our hands warm. We'd be like digging through all the seashells and we would just make sea glass collections. We thought it was the coolest thing in the world, but yeah, we would get them all right here. It's super gloomy. Like, can you imagine like going out on a boat right now? I feel like I'd be shaking in my boots, just going into the abyss. Like, where does it lead? You know what I mean? I mean, in reality, I know where it leads. Like I think Providence and like Massachusetts is like far across the water. But I mean, I don't know. That just looks intimidating, doesn't it? You're just like waiting for like a sea urchin to come out of the water and snatch you and pull you in. Anyway, these are just some of the spots that, you know, I have a lot of childhood memories at. So I figured while I'm here, I'd show you guys a little bit and share some stories. Mm -hmm. 